Hello my peepers, this is Shalene of the Color in Book Nook and this is another flip through. This is all of the Johanna Basford books that I own. So let's get started. All the links will be down below for Amazon. I am an Amazon associate, which means I make a few cents off your order when you use my link. There is no cost to you using my link. Okay, so we have, um, I was keeping track, pages done. So it opens up to this flap so you can color in that. And then you have your nameplate. <clears throat> well, actually, this is your nameplate. That's just the title page. This is the nameplate. Her pages are two-sided, and this is a storybook along with a coloring book. So I have colored a few pages in here. Some I did as color alongs. I might have done some as buddy colors. I still have a lot more to do. I wanted to get, give this to my great niece who just turned two or she's turned, she's turned three, I think. I don't think I will get this done for her. <laughs> I wanted to have it done pretty much already and with all the coloring books I have that's just not happening. The story in here is very very cute. I did read the story when I first got this. In fact when this came out I didn't want it. And Catherine said yes you need to get it. I'm like, but I don't really want it. And so Catherine got it for me. And after seeing other people coloring in it, and after reading the story, I ended up falling in love with this book. But yeah, I'm one of those that doesn't always have to have every artist's coloring book if I don't care for it. I try to, but if it's not something I think I will color in, But I ended up falling in love with this book. And you can do so much in here. And the, it is a thick paper. It's cardstock. But do not use your alcohol markers in it. You can use watercolors in that. <laughs> but I do really like the story in here it is very cute Trying to cover up the words because of copyright, you know. There's nasty people out there who try to copy things. This was a color along that Emily Illustrator did last year.
dragons. <laughs> All the butterflies. And here's your test page. So that is for Ivy and the Inky Butterfly. This one is World of Flowers. And again, you have a fold out cover you can color. Title, the nameplate. Tips for color and, and introduction. And again, papers, cardstock, double sided, so you would not be able to use alcohol markers unless you don't really care about the picture behind it. I've seen so many pages colored out of this, it is so cool. <clears throat> This was a buddy color that I did with Sheila, Candace, and Lisa, and I used Mitsubishi Unis. And this was one that I, was a buddy color with Lori Duffy, and I used my Amazon Basics and Poscas. I used Posca pens in the black and the blues. <laughs> That's rascal. He came in here because he wanted me to pet him, but I was doing this. So now he's going to walk through the house crying because he's not getting pet. That's what he does. They have some really pretty pictures. Really like that. You know, me with the houses and the mushrooms. And then you have a color palette page and this here folds out so you have several <laughs> like poster type things. So again that one was World of Flowers. This is Johanna's Christmas. I was hoping to have this done by now but you know best laid plans. Again, it's cardstock, your nameplate, the difference with these, I believe they are all one-sided, so you can use your um, alcohol markers. So this one I did watching Julie's Passion for Coloring. I used Prismacolor pencils, a black Sharpie, and a white Posca pen. This is, I used gel pens only. This I, was a buddy color with Lisa. I used all the Black Widow sets, the gel pens, and Prismacolor pastels for the background. You have a double spread. This one, I not. I think it was with Julie's passion for coloring. I'm not positive. No. Hmm. Now I really don't remember. I don't remember at all what I did this with. I think it was done with Prisma colors, some gel pens, and the pan, 
and um, the Prisma Pastels. <coughs> this was for a Christmas in July color lawn that I did with Jen. This was a buddy color I did with Troy, and I used Prismas, gel pen, stickles, and navy acrylic for the background. This was a buddy color with Catherine, and I used gel pens and fine liners. <coughs> this was a buddy color with Martina, and I used gel pens and Wink of Stella. This was a Christmas in July color lawn that I did with Jen and Anne from A Colorful Life. <coughs> Sorry about that. And I colored this. I watched Julie's Passion for Coloring. I used Prismacolor pencils and pastels for the background and gel pens. This was a Christmas in July color along. This was a Christmas in July 2018 and it was also a buddy color with Mary Ellen. And I used Holbein's and gel pens and metallic paint. This one I did watching Julie's Passion for Coloring. I used a black acrylic paint for the background. Everything else is done with Prismacolor pencils, even in here. And a white Posca pen. This I did watching Julie's Passion for Coloring, and I used Prismacolor pencils. This was Christmas in July 2018 with Jen. This also was a buddy color I did with Color Raru and Erica, and I used my Pablo pencils, gel pens, and pan pastel where the red is. This one was a color along with simple art for adults, and I used Prismacolors and gel pens. This one I watched Julie's Passion for Coloring, used Prismacolor pencils, a white Posca pen, and pan pastel for the background. This one was a Christmas color lawn that I did with Jen and I was the hostess for this one. I used a Marco Ruffin's gel pens, stickles, Posca pen, and a white Uniball pen. This one I used Prismacolor pencils and a Posca pen. The black is the Posca pen, the silver is a silver Posca pen, and just the purple and the birds were done with Prismacolor pencils. And then I started this um, watching Dream in Color. And I need to finish it. This one I did watching Julie's Passion for Coloring. I used Prismacolor pencils, a black Sharpie marker for the background, and a white Posca pen. This is Prismacolor pencils as well. Okay, this was a Christmas in July color lawn where Jen was the hostess for this one. And I don't remember what I used. I think the background are Neo 2's though. Uh. <laughs> okay, this was a Christmas color along. Grace was the hostess for the week. And I used my Karen Dosh Super Colors and gel pens. And that's Joanna's Christmas. 
This is Enchanted Forest. So you have a dusk jacket, your nameplate, I need, looks like I need the color in this one. I think I have, just don't know when. Don't know where in here I colored. Well, I thought it did, yep. There's the one, I did the rabbit. I don't know what I used. I know there's stickles there, but other than that, I don't know what the pencils were. And I believe I followed along a video with this, but I can't remember with who. I'm not positive. I might not have, but I think I did. I really like this page. This was a color lawn I did with someone, I can't remember who. This was with Peta Hewitt. Okay, this one was... I don't know. I have written down Rebecca the Book Nester. So I must have colored a lawn with her. This is color. Um, I used Stabila Fine Liners Crayola Super Tip Markers. But I have Rebecca the Book Nester down for that. So I don't know if I colored a lawn with her. Or if I did a buddy color with her. And this one is a huge ass. <laughs> Both sides flip out. Yeah, you have a lot there to color. <clears throat> and then what's hidden in the pages. So that one is Enchanted Forest. This one is A Lost Ocean. Again, you have a dusk jacket. The nameplate. Where you can find the hidden objects to look for in the book, the introduction. And this is when I first started coloring. This one, I believe, was with Peta Hewitt. And maybe that one, too. I think this was with Peter Hewitt. I did I didn't write it down at the time. Now I write everything in my books when I can. And I won't swear that it was with Peter Hewitt, but that's what I think. This one I don't know if I did this one on my own or with someone. I do not remember.
jellyfish. They have some really pretty pictures. And then keys to the lost ocean. So, yep. This one is Secret Garden. This also has a book jacket. Have your nameplate. Two page spread, double sided again. This page I'm I'm using to check out my different pencils to see what pencils I like in here. And I know the background on this is done with pit pens. I do not have any information for that one, what I used or anything, so I'm not sure. This one was a buddy color that I did with Tina Diamond and Kathleen Wilson. Kathleen Goth Wilson. Now you can hear the furnace running and I've got the wash machine going and the dryer going. <laughs> All kinds of noises in the house tonight. This one was done watching Emily Illustrator. I was so thrilled with the water. I really liked it and I would probably do water like that again. I would have to watch her video again to remember how we did the water. And I can't remember what pencils we used. And I don't remember what I used on this page. Some people can remember everything they've used in their coloring books. I can't do that. <clears throat> okay, and this is Magical Jungle. 
And again, well, this doesn't have a dust jacket, just folds over. You have your nameplate, which I never finished. <laughs> this was like the first time I ever started using colored pencils. I had no clue what the freak I was doing. And I believe this was, was, with a, was it with Anxiety Art Adventures? Facebook group and you only could use pinks, purples, and greens, I think. I think. Not positive. It was a long time ago. This I did with my Mitsubishi Unis. This is done with Prismacolors and Fine Liners. This was a color lawn on a Colorful Life's channel. She did several in here. And I forgot. I think I watched somebody do this, but oh. Tutorial was Mia Fox. That's who did this. I have it written down. Mia Fox. This also was done with a colorful life. It was a color along. This also was with A Colorful Life. This one was done with Mama Loves to Color. Or Mama Loves, yeah, Mama Loves to Color. And this was with Prisma Pencils. This one I don't remember what we used. I think I did these on my own. I don't think that I watched anybody color these. This was also a color along with a colorful life. And I don't remember what we used. This, I. Th yeah. For some reason, I'm thinking Jessica Roberts, but Jessica's coloring corner, but I'm not positive. This one, I watched someone color this. Maybe it was Julie's Passion for Coloring or Chris Chang. I don't remember. And that's it. Oh no, there's some more here. There's one there. Yeah, this is must be the one that has extras in the back. And they're perforated. So that is for Johanna Basford. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.